Hey, what's up YouTube? I will be here. Today I'm going to bring you a video on how to install Minecraft shaders for Minecraft Ops Find 1.8. And um, before I start the video, just note that this version of the mod isn't compatible with Loptifine. And I will be uploading a video um, later once it is released um, on how to um, get it with Optifine. So if you want to see that, be sure to subscribe. So anyways, what you're first going to want to do is run Minecraft 1.8. So just open up Minecraft and go to the profile with your name on it or whatever you choose and click edit profile hit release 1.8 and save it and click play just let it load up and basically um, once it has loaded up to the loading screen you're, you're fine you can close out of minecraft then what you're going to want to do is click the first link i have in the description which is the download for which is a link to um the shaders mod page which has all the versions and you're going to want to go scroll down a bit and as, as you can see it says for minecraft 1.8 make sure you choose the latest version and just click it click the link and it'll take you to a page and as you can see it says download just hit download and then it'll take you to the download page And just let it load up. And then hit download. And then minimize Chrome. And then you just want to get it installed. So then go to um, wherever you downloaded it. And right click it. Click open with. And click Java platform binary. And just agree to all of it. And it will open up a little installer. And as you can see, it said successfully installed. So what you want to do to make sure it's installed correctly is um, just open up Minecraft and make sure you have a profile that says 1.8 Shaders Mod. Now, um, in order to get the effects and um, shadows and stuff like that, we're going to need shader packs, which um, as you installed it, it doesn't have those included um, already with the mod. So um, then I'm um, just minimize Minecraft and click the link I have in the description and it is a link to a download page for all of the shader packs and as you can see I'm right here then just hit download save it to wherever you want and then minimize Chrome go to wherever you saved it and open it up and as you can see that there's a shader packs folder right here if you open it up it shows all the shader packs so anyway just go back and go back to Minecraft and click edit profile click open up game directory and all you have to do is drag and drop this into the dot minecraft folder and then you're good you can close out of all this and then just um, start launch minecraft on make sure you're on the 1.8 shaders mod profile <coughs> as you can see it's loading up and you're going to want to go to single player multiplayer whatever you want um, if you want to come test it out on my server, the IP is mc.phantompvp.net. That's what I'm going to be showing you guys on. So um, just open it up. All right, and once you have loaded in, to make sure you have installed it correctly, you're going to want to hit Escape, go to Options, and click Shaders. Um, well, basically, the Shaders button should be there. If you follow this video exactly like I have done, it should be here and um, click it and it should show all of the shader packs as you can see right here and just choose any of the shader packs and as you can see um, this is shaders so yeah let me make it day as you can see I have um, lighting effects and all that stuff all the good stuff that shaders bring so um yeah guys um, be sure to subscribe if you want to see another video on the, this version of the mod with Optifine and um, yeah guys, thank you guys for watching and um, be sure to give a like and uh, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe.